friends, Jerry Rosa here in the Rosa String Works Workshop. Today is my first day back to work after my second mini vacation down to Mountain View, Arkansas. That was the vacation to recover from the other vacation. <laughs> I tell you, after I got back from our quote unquote northeastern vacation, I was wore out. I mean, that was a lot of driving and I was just just dead tired, to be perfectly honest with you, for for several days, about a week really it took me to re get going. And so then my wife and my two daughters left to go to Italy, believe it or not, and they're in, presently in Italy. So I thought, well, if they're going to be gone, I might as well go back to Mountain View with my buddy Bruce from down in Oxford, Mississippi. Spent the weekend down there uh, jamming, and Bruce was down there, and... Uh, you know, met a lot of nice people. Uh, Bob Bird is a viewer of the channel, saw him down there, and he's a good singer. And I wanted to get him on film singing his auctioneer song, and we just didn't get make that happen, unfortunately. But uh, he's he was a, a professional auctioneer for years, and uh, of course, would, you would know then, he could do a good job on the auctioneer song. So, uh, Bob, I enjoyed uh, jamming with you and, and meeting you and your wife. I also met a fellow, believe it or not, from Norway. And this was kind of like the peak of the weekend. And it happened at the last moment of the weekend. We were just about to quit on Saturday evening and up strolled this fellow from Norway. And his name is Jarla Oberstrad, is how I believe he pronounced it, Obrus. Thad. <laughs> I'm not positive about the perfect pronunciation of the last name, but that's pretty close. Obra Stad. And he gave me his CD, which I have not listened to at all yet. I don't have a CD player in my car. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to throw together a bunch of uh, pictures from my northeastern vacation and up in Canada and I'll put some labels under there so you know what you're looking at and I'm going to feature music from Yarla and I'm also going to feature music from Jamie who we met up in Canada you saw in the last in that other video where we were Jamie and I were jamming together Jamie gave me a CD also and I got to tell you while it's not bluegrass at all it's very good music so Jamie's actually playing electric guitar and there's a trumpet player and they really do a good job playing together and I know you'll enjoy that so we're going to set those we're going to set these musics as the backdrop for the pictures you're about to see hope you enjoy it. I also have a video clip of Yarla and myself jamming to uh, a tune I believe you'll recognize. And to my friends who sent me this wonderful candy, thank you. <laughs> Hello friends, Yarla Rosa here at Mountain View, Arkansas, and uh, just met a new friend from Norway. His name is Yarla Oberstad. Obrestad. Yeah. Obrestad. Yeah, Obrestad. That, that's right. I'm close. I'm an American. You know, what can I say? <laughs> that's about as good as it gets. Uh, Yarla um, also gave me a copy of his CD, and we'll be featuring that on a couple of, uh, you know, videos down the road, so uh, you'll get to hear his music. But right now, we're just having a good time jamming, so I think we're going to jam to a little tune called Salt Creek. Salt Creek. So, uh, Yarla, you kick it off. Okay.
good. That was fun. That was really fun. He's got his uh, Martin Travel guitar is what they call that, I believe. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Traveler. And you're here, and you're, he's headed to, uh, what, Nashville next, is that right? Yeah, that's right. And you're going to spend a little time down there. Do you have uh, any plans down in Nashville? Yeah, I'm going to listen to music. Just going to listen? Yeah. Well, as good as you are, you ought to be on stage. You think so? <laughs> I think so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, friends, so uh, we'll feature some of uh, Yarla's music here, and uh, I know you're going to enjoy that.
This is what people call a trail in Maine. Uh, I call this a boulder path. I don't really see a trail here. Do you see a trail here? This is crazy. <laughs> This is uh, what the people in Maine say is an easy trail to come down. So there's my wife up there and she's coming down this little trail that I just came down. It's easy, no problem at all. This is some more of that really easy trail that we're walking down to get down the mountain. This, everybody said, yeah, going down is really easy, no problem. <laughs>
Yeah.